Well, tonight we are hearing from a passenger who was aboard the New Jersey Transit Riverline train that crashed Monday morning. She gave our Aziza Shula a firsthand account of the absolutely terrifying incident. When I close my eyes, all I can see is that picture of glass falling over me and being in darkness and hearing metal tearing and just the smell. I, I, I can still smell the smell. It's been more than 24 hours and Lori Zimbalardi can't seem to shake reliving the memory of the near death experience she survived. A scene out of a horror movie. That's how it felt. Zimbalardi and her boyfriend boarded the New Jersey Transit Riverline train in Trenton Monday around 6 a.m. The couple was commuting to work in Philadelphia along with 40 other passengers when the train hit a tree on the tracks just north of Roebling Station in Manhattan. Mansfield Township. Before I knew it, I was up against a door out of my chair and we just kept going. I was just waiting for an impact and we were lifted so high up, the doors opened so none of us really could get out. Zimbalardi says she suffered a concussion, broken teeth and minor cuts. Sadly, the train conductor, 41 year old Jessica Haley, a single mother of three boys, was killed. Oh my God, I saw her. the whole tree pushed her out of her cab into our department. We saw her laying there. I didn't know she was a mom. All I can say is I give them my condolences. Believe it or not, Zimbalardi says at the same time of morning last Friday, she was aboard the Riverline light rail train that struck a truck in Burlington, New Jersey. So the thought of boarding another train terrifies her. Unfortunately, public transportation is her only option right now to get her to her job as a dental assistant in South Philly. It makes you realize how short life is. Aziza Schuler, CBS News, Philadelphia.